Uh, here we are for the public meeting for project uh, Riverside Drive. Please mute yourself during the presentation. This meeting is being recorded for future viewing in the city's YouTube channel. It will be uploaded in the city's YouTube channel later on. Please mute yourself to avoid echo or any background noises. As I said, this uh, project title is the Riverside Drive Street Maintenance Project. Uh, my name is Tariq Islam. I work for the City of Fort Worth Transportation Public Works Department. I will be the project manager. The city inspector for the project will be Cody Horton. The contractor will be Texas Beat. The construction cost of the project is approximately 1.5 million. The, the construction will start in April 5, 2021 and expected to complete in October 2021. Here you can see the project map. The limit starts from the south um, on East Avenue, which is one block south of East Lancaster Avenue, and it will go all the way to the north up to Belknap Street. At this moment, um, gas company is working in the north side of this project area, but they will be done in a few weeks. So our contractor is gonna start the project from south end of our limit, which is the East Avenue, where the um, pavement changes from concrete to asphalt and will move towards north. Scope of work. Uh, in this project, there will be select re replacement of ADA compliant curb ramps, sidewalks, curb and girder, drive approaches, and obviously, roadway resurfacing. Here are some examples of the work we perform under this project. On the left of the screen, you will see the existing driveway and, and uh, carbon girder. Uh, I think it is there's some settlement there. That's why you see it. Please, whoever joined, please mute yourself. Uh, this this meeting is being recorded. So if you have any question, please use the chat box. This is TJ Brown with Texas Bid. I just got on, sorry. Okay, no problem. Just mute yourself. As I said, uh, you see the some settlement on the carbon girder and the driveways and those kind of carbon girder and driveways will be replaced along the roadway. And there are some damages in the carbon girder and uh, the driveway, those will be re replaced as well. So you'll see that as an example on the right of the screen, uh, what will be to look like after the replacement. There are some car ramps along the roadway, those are not ADA compliant. You'll see on the left of the screen, those kind of car ramps will be replaced under these projects along the roadway. And on the right side, of the right side of the screen, you will see an example of ADA compliant ramps. There are some sidewalks are damaged or have some trip hazard. Those sidewalks will be replaced as well in this project. And there are some gaps in the sidewalk on the, uh, along the roadway. So those small gaps will also be filled up with the new sidewalk. You'll see the example on the left side of the screen, kind of trip hazard. On the right side of the screen is an example what it should be look like after the replacement. On the left side of the screen, this is the existing Riverside Drive. The paving, condition of the paving is not that good. So this paving, this two inch paving will be removed and new, pave, new asphalt pavement will be installed. And on the right side of the screen, you will see 
what it should be look like after the paving is complete, along with some uh, pavement marking will be installed. What to expect during construction? You understand that construction is always some kind of messy, so it has to be some construction impact during uh, some impact will be there during construction. Um, additional equipment will be there. Some parking will be limited, and there will be some sounds and dust in the construction zone. So we will uh, may, uh, put uh, all efforts to minimize those construction impacts. There will be enough construction signage in place in the in the work zone. And all, if there are any temporary closures are needed, it will be communicated ahead of time. And no equipment will be staged in an area that will prevent uh, the residents' access or parking. And residents will be, or the business owners will be informed thoroughly during the construction. And like we will pass the notice ahead of the construction, uh, electronic message board will be there. Regular working hours will be Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 6 p.m. Here is the contact information. Uh, any question for the project, please contact me. Uh, my phone number is here. My email address is here. So I will be available for answering any question. Any questions? I don't think we have any residents or property owner attended this meeting. So I hope there will be no question from the city rep. Is there any question? I believe hey, there's please. someone trying to speak, um, but I think she's still muted and I see her Rick, I believe speaking. Janelle is trying to talk, but she's uh, on mute. Janelle, are you able to use the chat box? Ma'am, can you unmute yourself? Yeah, there's a mute button in the in the bottom of the screen. Just, Just click, click the, the mute. The bottom of I the screen. I do have a question or a comment. This is TJ Brown okay. with Texas Fit. I'm on TJ. What? No, we, let uh, him just hit. I'll I'll ask in a minute. I found okay. it. Oh, sorry. No, go um, ahead. We we did uh, confirm this is going to start April fifth, correct? Everybody's correct. good with that. Okay, correct. great. So tell the question you have, TJ. Yeah, I have. That's it. I was just I was just making sure everybody was aware of that. Yeah, you missed that part. Yes, we already uh, notified that construction will start on April five, and from the it will start going to start from the south end of the project limit. Yes, okay. go ahead, ma'am. Right. Ma okay, I have a few questions. First of all, I have a business on Riverside Drive. You say that residents will have access. What about our customers? Will they be able to get to our business? Definitely, ma'am. No access will be completely closed. We will leave uh, at, at least one driveway open to for the access. And if there is only one driveway, we will work with you to leave it open at least a half of the drive for the access. Excellent. Thank you. I have one more question. Um, a couple of days ago, there were some people who were uh, contractors for the gas company, I believe, and they're going to put a new gas line in. Um, and it's right at very close to the intersection of Riverside Drive and East First. Now, how is that going to conflict with what you're doing? Or will that take a long time? You're correct, ma'am. Uh, uh, at this moment, uh, gas company is working, so they will be done within few weeks, and we'll and you gonna, you, uh, we'll we will follow them. We're going to start after okay. they're done. So we okay. uh, in April when you're going to start that portion of the roadway, there is no gas work. So there are no gas work right now at that uh, at that location, like south side of the project limit. <laughs> They are working at this moment on the north side, and they will be done in a few weeks, and we will follow them. So it should not be an overlap on the work. 
Okay, excellent. And do you have any uh, any uh, broad idea about when how long it will take? Just my just I'm just curious. Yes, ma'am. We're going to start in April, and hopefully, if everything goes right, it should be complete by October 2021. Wow, October. Okay. Okay. It's a long, right, it's a long, gonna it's a long, long stretch, ma'am. We're going to start from Lan south, of, south of Lancaster to Belknap. It will take time, some time. And sorry for sure. the inconvenience. No, no, but you'll do a section at a time, correct? Correct. You're going to go block by block, section at a time. Thank you very much. You're That's welcome. all I have. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for the opportunity to uh, learn and, and ask questions. No problem, man. You're always welcome. If any question later on, please call me or email me. I will be available to answer any questions. Can you put your information back up? Yes, it's right here. Can you see the screen, ma'am? All I see is questions. Oh, I got it. Yes, let me copy that. Thank you so much. You're welcome, ma'am. I've, I've asked all the questions I want. All right, ma'am. Is there any question? Any other question for anyone, any other else? Okay, looks like we'll not have any other questions. And my contact information is, as I stated, is here. So if anybody has any question later on, please contact me. And with that, uh, we adjourn this meeting. Thank you all again. Thank you. All right. Thank you.